Hello, it's Ricardo, and I'm playing Elite Dangerous. I'm investigating a distress call, and I'm in the sector that houses the Oracle space station. Now, the Oracle has been recently attacked by Thargoids, and there's been a rescue effort ongoing to rescue all those refugees and supply the station with materials. But at the moment, that is still going on. But this distress call caught my eye. Now, if you haven't already done so, please get the like and subscribe button and look for that notification icon as well. That'll let you know when I'm putting more videos on YouTube. The distress call is evident as soon as you drop into the sector. Also, you'll find some other ships, the Sanchez Science Ship, the Naphtha class carrier. But this distress call is around this high metal content world, this Satan looking planet with its magma showing through its sort of shiny grey exterior. Now, this is an Imperial distress call. I know this because I did the video. I didn't know whether it was Federation or what to begin with. But it really is another Imperial distress call. Lots of cutters. Imperial capital ships floating around. And of course, our friend... Yours and mine, the old Thurgi, the Class 7, the Medusa. Yes, the Medusa Thargoid is here, and we can only say has caused this distress call. And there he is, with all his spiky goodness on the end of those tendrils. Now, I haven't got my Type 7, I've got the glint of the badger's eye with me, my beluga, because I was doing some passenger missions. So I'm sort of being quiet about it holding back but in system there are quite a few items escape pods intelligence honesty pills hmm honesty pills i think i've said this before what's all that about but that's where you get them if you're looking for honesty pills if there's a community goal or something that says i want some honesty pills you're gonna find them with one of these big federation um or imperial fubars it's got to be a Fubar, because they've rocked in you with a capital ship, and their cutters, and all the rest of the other Imperial stuff, and they've just been mown down. Now, I've said it before with some of the other distress calls that have gone off. I think some of the Federation ones. So, what? Hang on. You didn't think to pack any Thargoid weaponry, did you? And hey, they might have. But all I'm saying is I don't see any Thargoid carcasses, or broken hulls anywhere. Perhaps the Thargoids look after their dead and take take their dead with them so no further technology can fall into, you know, human hands. But a wide range of items that if you scoop all those up, you can more than likely sell them to, to the Oracle Station that's looking for virtually everything to try and rebuild it. So a couple of distress calls as well that give, when scanned, a Thargoid ship signature. That's all well and good. But the Thargoid pretty much left us alone. I didn't irritate it or aggravate it too much. Even when I flew right at it. Um, it sort of like sent the Thargons at me. But even with the pitiful engines on this Beluga, I was able to escape and get out of dodge with a minimal amount of damage. Now, I haven't fitted this ship out with a Xeno scanner. It's not what this ship's all about. This ship's for doing passenger missions and rescue missions and uh, doing a bit of a grind. So anyway, there you have it. I've been Ricardo. This has been a distress signal in the station system of the Oracle, which is the Pallades sector, IR-W space D1-55. Thanks very much for watching and check back soon for more videos in the series.